So yeah, here's the red triangle that ties into the Bass logo. Luma panties. Eastern Star. So, uh, so what's that? A cup of filth? Uh, let's do a bit of research on what that cup symbolizes. This ties in with the YMCA. Um, that's very interesting. We might get onto that in a minute. Connection with YMCA. Big connection there. Little frat lad. Frat lad from the States. Or some sort of wannabe gangster rapper. I don't know what that. Is that some fraternity uh, shirt? I'm not quite sure. Here we go, Knights of Malta. And then red triangles. There we go, Order Out of Chaos. Nice 33 there, Russell Brand. Kindercare. So, Kindercare is interesting. Um, that ties in with Scientology. And, um, uh, and, and Kinder is a massive association. Um, lots of it's a corporation ties in but it, you know it's massive uh, lots of tentacles involved with that and Scientologists are all around Kinder Care and um, you can be sure the government are as well Luton Airport <clears throat> so Peter Oakley's father um, RSE's mentor um, Peter Oakley's father was the mayor of Luton so again here we have the um, Masonic uh, logo Mitsubishi so you know this tie in the um, Orient Lodges and um, you know obviously the Triads use the uh, red triangle don't they as well so no surprise here Mitsubishi we'll have to just decode that one I haven't decoded Mitsubishi so here we go the Bass Chakra I mean Base Chakra or should I say base chakra? Bass chakra, I mean. <laughs> All about the base. I wonder what Peter Oakley showed RSE about base chakra and the all C and I pyramid. Right, just for it um, as well, in this one, we've got the squared circle as well, which is very pre, pre Masonic. And there, it ties in with the Orient Lodges as well. And we all know that these guys are into, you know, the chakras. Hindu mysticism. Here we go. East Lancashire Lodge. Oh, Freemasons. Uh, so here's Brown Saturn's eyes logo. His uh, head and shame. So yeah. YouTube. <laughs> yep. Well, you know. So you know, it's interesting how the red triangle ties in with the gay scene. And it has always, you know, it's been used a lot in 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 that movement. Uh, YMCA used it as a logo as well. So you know, there you go. Village people, uh, watch out for the village people in the entertainment industry. So I haven't made any um, solid connections with this organisation. Don't know much about it, but uh, just going by the logo, I'd say it's uh, uh, ties in with a lodge somewhere, a Freemasonic lodge. Uh, probably, but I don't know too much about this one. We'll be honest. Um, this is off of uh, a channel on YouTube. I dare to mention. Uh, it's a little wink, wink, nudge, nudge going on here. And there's a bit of play, a bit of cryptography going on here with the red triangle symbolism. But it speaks for itself. Uh, got the rotary wheels here, so that's a heads up to, to the rotary wheel, the Freemasons as well. Yeah, it's all relevant, and uh, I'm not going to even mention the channel's name, but. All of these channels are connected, and we'll get to this because this isn't just about tech and RSE. Never was. I've always known that there's a lar large um, group on YouTube, all affiliated together in a massive pyramid, red triangle scheme. <clears throat> it's been I've been watching them for months. So yeah, there's a heads up to you know communism as uh, and you know. Do we need to talk about the phallic and anal symbology of that, uh, that symbol? But yeah, octagon, got a triangle here, a squared circle, Satan's bum hole, and the sort of penetration of the hammer of communism. So there you go, take it up your ass, or however which way you want. But not for me, thank you, dear. Um, <clears throat> this is um, the 
logo of Baron of Ant Hill, Ant Hill, um, the infested hill that we all become in too aware, well aware of in Bedford. It's becoming also very relevant to me, um, well, very transparent, you know, there's more look into this, that Antville is a quite an important place, to say the least. And I would say this, that Christchurch and the whole satanic scandal from Christchurch is actually a smokescreen and a um, cover for what's actually going on at Antville and probably other places as well. Arion. Okay, this is the um, Arion Corporation with the um, new Arion jet um, owned by the Bass family. So the Bass family are oil barons in America. So you can research that one. Uh, There's a ramp for School of Enlightenment. More in Scientologists and more RSE symbolism of ramp for School of Enlightenment. And they um, piggyback off the Eye of Ra and ties you know so more Scientology, which is also linked to RSE and his cronies and co. Raw Arch is what I was trying to think of just now. Um, the anonymous speaks for itself. Uh, communism without a face. And there's the red triangle and, you know, talking the satanic colours as well that the Freemasons like to piggyback off. Here's uh, Russell Brand's head up to the uh, red triangle in the 33 Club. He's he's part of it. Yeah, magazine article. Um, you know, Luma Panties, Scientology. Um, there's Hubbard. Can't quite work out who those guys are, but that's Hubbard because Hubbard's up the, um, you know, so Hubbard's part of this red triangle operation, this MK Ultra operation. Uh, more, more grand, you know, another Freemason lodge in Maine. There you go. There's, you know, we've got the red triangle symbolism here as well. With, you know, there's a lot, you know, but this is ultimate. This is all tied in as well. There you go, Bass. Oh, what Freemasons? Right, so that's that. It's just a little post I put up on Facebook. Right, so what else have I been looking at? How does this tie in for you folks? Um, how can I explain this? Right, so we're starting to find me and Crossman. I'll just say this quickly because I'm running out of time. I've got 15 minutes. Um, we're starting to find um, a tie-in with mental health um, and charities. So I've been looking at charities today. Um, in uh, the UK, <clears throat> so moving on because that's not too relevant. Uh, like I say, more charities I've been looking at today. Moving on, what else is this? Yeah, some cars look up on the Bible. Um, here's Arion Corporation, as you can see here. Um, Robert Bass, key key people. So you know, this is very interesting. The Bass. Red triangle. It's going to be flying in the sky. They're going, going supersonic, guys. And so owned by no, Mr. Bass. But I thought this is interesting. The name of Arion is derived from mythical, mythical horse Arion, which belonged to Adrastus and was born under Demeter and Poseidon. I thought that's very interesting because that's again that's got the Trinity. So this is all very interesting. More to find out about this. I do feel. Yeah, there's a tie-in here to Antville and um, a trainer that's being made in um, Antville and the company, the, the Croft, with, with the um, the one with the crocodile, the croc. Um, so that's going to come out soon as well, tying that in. Lots to tie in, guys. You know, trying to get my head around all of this. Me and Crossman have done so much on this the last couple of weeks. You know, it's just don't know how to explain it all in one go but we'll get there all in good time um, so I've been do, doing some re research on the YMCA that's going to be very relevant how this ties in um, how you know the church is tied into charity that's very relevant so lots of research there to do there more on the YMCA like I say so the, the YMCA you can tell of this symbol here so this is the tie-in with Rome in the YMCA and we're all trade. So I've been doing some research on that as well today. Um, that ties in. We'll get on to that again. I won't get stuck in it now because uh, I'm just giving you, you know, just a rundown of what I've been looking at today. I've been doing a bit of research on Hubbard and Dianetics. There's um, the book 
here of Dianetics, guys, um, look, you've got the red triangle here of the, um, the volcano. So the peace fin symbol, the, the um, volcanic god of, you know, of uh, Spock, <laughs> you know, and all of that crazy Scientology is just a parable. Um, and the red triangle logo sticks up here. So, you know, what I'm getting is, is that, you know, the red triangle represents for, you know, the Babylon mystery schools, satanic cults, represents the trinity of fire. Um, that like and is in the Hellfire Club. It's a, but it's a heads heads up to transhumanism and the devil um, and you know the Trinity of the Whore of Babylon. The, you know the going back. You know it's the, it's the, the Trinity is Horus, um, Isis, Osiris, and Horus. But um, anyway, this is you know, so interesting symbology. Like I say, on the volcano on the Dianetics religion of Scientology. Cut it now because I'm out of time. You know, hopefully I can get some more videos now done.